We begin this morning with the investigation into a deadly workplace shooting near Chicago. Authorities in Aurora, Illinois, say 45-year-old Gary Martin was let go from his job at a manufacturing warehouse Friday when he opened fire on his co-workers. Five employees at the Henry Pratt facility were killed. One other was wounded. Police say Martin also shot at responding officers, wounding five of them. They are expected to recover. Martin was shot and killed by police following an intensive search of the 20,000 square foot facility. Adriana Diaz is in Aurora. Adriana, what else do we know about the shooter right now? Well, Dana, we've learned that Gary Martin was a 15-year employee of the company. And while police don't know what motivated the shooting, they say the violence unfolded on the day he was being terminated from his job. They don't know if he initially came to work with his weapon or if he left and came back with it. Aurora's requested as many ambulances as possible for an active shooter with many injuries. 911 calls started flooding in at 1.24 p.m. Friday, reporting gunfire at the Henry Pratt Manufacturing Building, which makes industrial parts. Approximately four minutes later, the officers arrived on scene and were immediately confronted by Gary Martin, a 45-year-old man armed with a handgun. Police say it appears Martin fired at the first responding officers from a window, hitting one officer while he was still outside. The suspect struck four other policemen inside, all within the first five minutes. Because it was ta 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 oh, So, wow. yeah, and um, it was like in space and then came, came another shot. After an hour and a half of searching the 29,000 square foot facility, officers located Martin, who was believed to be hiding. Gunfire was exchanged again at that time, and that's when uh, the that's when we we shot the shooter. Jake Simmons' mother was inside during the incident. She's just scared. Uh, you know, at the moment, she said that they heard some shots, so they uh, kind of took cover. Five of her co-workers were found dead in the building. I hate that we have to use the term classic workplace shooting. Um, that pains me to do so. Investigators executed a search warrant at the gunman's home, but nothing material was found. Jacqueline White was Martin's neighbor. He would keep him, his, his, like, his stuff to himself. I mean, he didn't really have that much visitors. He lives by himself. Now, Martin does have a criminal record. In 1995, he was arrested and charged for aggravated assault in Mississippi. Michelle? Tragic. Adriana, thank you.